Meanwhile, Ultratech's chances of winning the battle for bankrupt Binani Cement strengthened as lenders backed by the Aditya Birla Group companies bid, although the banks have left the matter to be decided by the Supreme Court. Neha uh, is joining us now on the phone with some uh, latest updates on that. Neha, what are you picking up? Indeed, this is a story we first reported on the 4th of uh, April. We did tell our viewers that uh, the lenders uh, have agreed uh, to back the Ultratech uh, deal, uh, that is the side deal they inked with the Nani Cement for transfer of about 98% stake for close to 7,200 crore rupees. And uh, we are now given to understand that today the lenders uh, have once again uh, reiterated that they would be eager to give their blessings to the deal, which they have found to be attractive in all counters. Basis, uh, the Supreme Court nods uh, that Binani Industries would have to get for this deal. So in a sense, what this really means is that the lenders are willing to go for an out-of-court settlement if Binani Industries is able to furnish a uh, Supreme Court uh, sanction for the out-of-court settlement because due to member NCLT does not have the powers to do so. And uh, once there is an out-of-court settlement, then of course lenders can go ahead with the deal with Binani Industries wherein they will go in for a full repayment of all loans to operational and financial creditors. Uh, and that will be financed from the money to be paid by Ultratech for about 98% stake in Binani Cement. As far as Dalmia Bharat is concerned, they were recognized to be the highest bidder originally with about a bid of 6,700 crore rupees. Uh, they, I'm told, are also contemplating legal options uh, and are considering knocking the doors of Supreme Court should the lenders consider an out-of-court settlement because according to Dalmia Bharat, any uh, contemplation of an out-of-court settlement would be outside the purview of IBC. And do remember, Binani Cement had been undergoing insolvency proceedings. In fact, it was in the last leg of uh, the insolvency proceeding when it had uh, recognized Dalmia Bharat to be the highest bidder. But then, of course, uh, we've been reporting all the twists and turns ever since in this saga where Ultratech uh, now seems to have won the confidence of lenders uh, with a higher bid which they find more attractive. Uh, but let's wait for the Supreme Court uh, blessings as far as uh, this out-of-court settlement is concerned to be able to say confidently if it's the end of the matter.